I'll start this with you, start listening. singing Christmas carols. I guess that seals it then. The scan's almost complete. I don't think that... Okay. Now, we are clear. So tell me again, what happened to these guys? Pretty much like any other time. Within minutes, being near anything festive, it just took hold. And they had nothing to protect them. No Halloween masks, no dreidels, nothing about death and despair. Nothing. Those poor sots. Are you sure they haven't made us? Because I'm not so sure about these names. Like Douglas P. Hitman? Yeah, and Fraser Despy. It's great. They won't know. Look, we can't be found out because we are in the other room. And if we discover that we are us here, then this whole thing is not going to go at all the way we want to. Okay, fair. But back to the matter at hand. Our mission is to de-Christmas all these other versions of us. How are we going to do that with these ones? We can't exactly ship a ton of coal into a hotel room. True. Because at least with all the other times, they were in their own houses, which are our houses. So we don't have to worry about looking weird showing up to our houses, even if we do have a truck full of coal. But the problem is now, is how we're going to get all that coal into that hotel room. Room service. Perfection. We can't go over there now. They're still over there. They're going to be caroling for hours. Oh, what do we do in the meantime? The show is really underrated. They're leaving. It is time to spread Christmas joy to the masses. Are you ready? Yeah. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the Service. This is definitely not Douglas B. Hitman. Um, this is Charles from this room, and I'd like to order 14 tons of coal. Thank you. That's that's it. Right? That was the last one. Yeah, that was it. That was the last one. We should be done. I'm gonna go wash up. Okay. Be good enough. Finally, go home and rid ourselves of all this nonsense. Isn't that right, Douglas? Hello? Hello? <laughs> oh, God bless us. Everyone.